Many stocks and hot shots take the green. Well, so much for that green flag. The 12 car, Joey Graham, getting collected over there by several guys. Coming out of turn four. <laughs> I'm serious. He's filming. He's filming. Is he? Into turn three and four. It's Kaufman, Miner, Till. Got to be number three now. Starting to walk the dog a little bit out there. It's Kaufman again. Over the stripe, Bo Miner. Godfrey Dean. Kaufman, Bo Miner, Jamie Godby, Jeff Dean, Ronnie Teal, your front five. Here we go. And just as we go green, a white smoke tail off the Pinto. Come on, buddy. I think I can, I think I can, I think I can get into the pit area. And he thought he can and he could. We'll stay green. Kaufman just as strong as he was last October at the showdown at Sonoy. Strong again here tonight. Miner doing everything he can in the white one car but is just not reeling him in. Best race out there right now for fourth position, the dueling 32s. Jeff Dean in the black 32, the blue 32, Ronnie Teal, and Teal ends up getting into the fourth place position. And how about Bobby Faulkner tonight? The 44 car running in the sixth place position. Probably one of the better runs that Bobby's ever had. Yeah, we've got a caution here on the front straightaway with a couple of cars locked up right down here in front of the grandstand, just down from our flag stand. He knows that the clock is ticking. And the green flag will fly. One more time tonight. Kaufman will take the white. One more time around for the Mississippi driver to take home yet another victory here on this difficult, icy, slick gumbo. And Kaufman will take it home, picking up the victory over Bo Miner. Jamie Godby will come home in the show position. Ronnie Teal will hold on for the fourth place position and Tifton's Eli Bradley makes the long trip up worthwhile with a top five finish.